This is the VEX VR video for the basketball drills level two program. In the first program, we made a robot go forward one square, back in reverse, then two squares, four squares, uh, ultimately. The level two program asks us to do the same thing, but without using the reverse block. So what we're gonna have to do is rotate our robot. So you can see I've already started this, basketball drills two, I've created a new file drive forward and back one grid block by turning. So what we're looking at is I've written my first line of pseudocode. So if I follow that pseudocode, I'm gonna drive forward 200 millimeters, which is one block. I'm going to turn right 180 degrees to rotate my robot. And then I'm going to drive forward again, 200 millimeters. But to put my robot in the original position, I'm going to have to turn that robot around again 180 degrees. I'm going to come up here and duplicate this piece of code. And I'm going to duplicate it twice and then attach it into my program. Now, the reason I duplicated my code is just to make it a little bit easier. So I'm going to uh, take a look, and I know in the second part, I need to go two grid blocks. So again, I'm using that comment as my pseudocode. And two grid blocks is 400 millimeters. In the third portion of my program, they're asking me to go four grid blocks. Four grid blocks would be 800. Again, four times 200 gives us that 800. Now I can come over here to my window of my playground and I can run this program. And again, what we should see is that robot making uh, that basketball drill run. And again, for those of you who like to see things at different angles, you can take a look at your robot's perspective. And we see that robot successfully navigating the requirements of this program. And again, the robot turns facing, even though that's not a requirement at the end of the program.